Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'm going to show you an important tip in Kateri 5. So sometimes uh, what happens uh, with the beginners when they try to use the compass for certain uh, options like creation of points, planes etc. They are not able to set the uh, compass back to the initial position. So in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can set the compass back and uh, in what cases uh, this kind of uh, technique can be useful so let's just say I'll just come to the part design workbench and I'll cr select a point and with respect to that point I'll just click on the point here and uh, what I'll do is I'll just bring this place it here I have uh, shown this way of creation of uh, mm, points in my old tutorial once you do this once you uh, keep the particular compass to any position you need then you have the option to click on the uh, compass location once you click on the compass location the uh, the coordinates w where the compass lies is being automatically calculated now if you click OK what happens is a point is created on the place where the compass is lying so let's just say we have used this compass so the whole point of uh, explaining this one was uh, about the usage of the compass now I've used the compass and it's not lying in the original position now I want to place it back to the original position so what would you basically do you'll just drag it like this and you would basically go back and you'll place it here so it's not really uh, you know getting placed the exact way it was uh, being there before so what you can really do is it's very simple but sometimes you would you don't find this option and maybe you miss it so just go to the reset compass and it simply sets back the compass to the initial position this method will be very simple but it's really hard that you know sometimes you really don't know where exactly a particular option is there and you waste a lot of time to set back uh, the compass so that's all for uh, this part of the tutorial and if you have any doubts clarifications please feel free to comment on my video or please feel free to write to me at kitia.pro.user at gmail.com catia.pro.user at gmail.com and I'll be uh, replying your mails whenever I find free time and that's all for this tutorial stay tuned guys thank you so much for watching